Hi there, Scorpio. I'm Jennifer Angel. These are your stars. Now, if you've been waiting for news to come through about your career or work, then that can come through um, this week or over the next couple of weeks. So uh, Mercury, the planet of communication, moves into your 10th house on the 1st. Um, so this is a time where you can start to talk about your business, your work or your career, um, maybe go into negotiations uh, and rediscuss things or just news to come through on a decision that you've been waiting on. So that's all, that's all good news there. Um, of course, you still have Jupiter all, all year, right up for another year, sitting in your seventh house of love. So uh, it's very possible that a lot of Scorpios will find their um, love of your life uh, this year. So that's, that's nice news. The only thing you need to be um, aware of or just um, curb a little bit when it's to do with love is not to have your expectations too high. I mean, we really only get disappointed when um, we expect too much. So uh, from a love level with this placing in your seventh house, um, you, you need to stay realistic. It's a lesson for you to learn to love unconditionally um, and to find out within you what it is that, where is your break point, what it is in your must-have love list of compatibilities and what you won't negotiate on. And that's okay. But, you know, once you get to that point, there are some things in life that you just have to ag agree to disagree on. Okay, so this is huge lesson for you on an intimate, more personal level over this next 12 months that you can learn. So it's all good news. Um, have a great week, Scorpio. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week. Bye.